let's talk about the time because it is now 8 47 and my car appointment was at 8 45. your girl never knows how to be on time for anything but it is definitely okay we're about to get the day started and i'm gonna do my best to vlog this weekend and if i doubt it is definitely okay too but yeah let's get started for the weekend y'all oh as soon as that car moved the sunset let me beep 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 but I'm about to be on my way to my car dealership to get my car service. See, now I don't like how the lights on it. But, yeah. Tune in and enjoy the ride, newbie babes. Mwah. Hey, Bookies, I know I am, a, a, shoot, a whole week late, but it is definitely okay getting to my Atlanta vlog weekend. So this was the outfit that I left the house with. If you're not shopping with something official, get into it officially. Do you hear me? <laughs> of course, I forget my wallet. Like, why, why would I, why would, why would I get, why would I get my, why would I be responsible and actually get everything together for all the house? Uh, I'm out of breath. It's crazy because I was going to come back to the house after my service appointment, but at this point, I said, let me just pack the car up all together, go get my package and just do what it is. I am literally like late. Like, I'm so late, it ain't even no funny how late I am, but I'm not even about to complain about being late because, again, you know, when you off, and you're enjoying your sleep, it's kind of like a, oh, you don't want to get up. And that was me. I, well, I don't even really know what my excuse was for not getting up. But, yeah. My behind is officially now on the way to my service appointment. Because, yeah, it was just a lot going on. Literally, just a lot going on. But, round five. <laughs> Newbie babes, as I waited for my car at Honda, I basically was getting ready actually to upload a new video, which was my mental health check in. So, this is just me basically taking you a little piece by piece of you know how I basically edit my thumbnails, what I kind of do when it comes down to editing thumbnails. Thumbnails aren't hard, but unless you got a good concept in your head of how you want it to look, you could just say abracadabra and it can look like this. So this was the final touch and I was ready to upload. My car service appointment kind of lasted way longer overdue than I did, but you want to know why? Your girl was late. But I came out to dark night looking freshly washed and I was sad because I knew after this it was not going to look like this anymore. I told you I was going to do good. We got poo poo in the passenger. She's the passenger princess for the weekend. Hi guys! And now it's time for us to get on the road. Go yeah. boss. Bing bong. Okay, bing bong. <laughs> Let me pause real quick so when we got to the airbnb we had a little situation with the check-in cool bada boom bada bang y'all see this little dog right here this little dog was on i-10 by 10 mind you it didn't even come like the dog didn't even start barking towards us when we first got there it literally like after we were struggling to get in the airbnb just ran up on us and just started barking because clearly we were in its territory but what i was trying to figure out was why was the dog like not in a little gated like area We are gonna get back in the car. Cause we we're not getting sick. And I ain't getting attacked by no damn dog. I mean I'ma kick it, but still. Uh, let's just say we watch a car. Well, sorry, a truck drive straight down. This was a straight shot. <laughs> we watched a truck drive into a bridge, and this was both of our faces. We're gonna reconnect it out. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> clearly we did. But we're getting some food. Dang, and this was literally right here. I need to. I gotta tie my shoelace before. I
But I just gotta give this a review of this avocado bacon burger, bacon chicken sandwich from Shake Shack. First of all, Shake Shack is it. Come on. too fancy. I, I, I have to. I cannot eat it whole. I don't know why. I can just everything. And if my chicken sandwich wasn't good, I would've showed you how she sliced it. It was real cunty. It made me feel cunty inside. Mm -hmm. Did they be one? Show you right on. That's a show right on. Alright, y'all. I'm gonna sit here on the little floor. This is the living room area. Love the fireplace. Love the couch. She has gave aesthetics. This is the kitchen. I don't know what that was, but this is the kitchen. This is a little seating area. Gotta get into the mirrors. Hold on. Oop. Play with your mama, not with me. So then we're gonna go to the master. We're gonna go to the master bedroom, and this is the room, honey. This is the room. Another mirror, another one. Thank you. This is the closet, and then we come here. More mirrors. <laughs> then this is the shower. I can't wait to get in this tonight. And then I love that this is a separate bathroom. So if you need to be in peace, you can be in peace. Love, love, love. So then when we leave out, let's, let's get into it. You see this hallway? Let me see you walk, 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 walk. This is another room. Another one. Thank you. And then, this is the shareable bathroom. Love, 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 love. love. Another mirror. And then, this is the last bedroom. Yes, let's get into it. 10 out of 10, highly recommend. So after we got all settled within the Airbnb, we also didn't realize how much time we didn't have and we were, everybody was just all over the place that was supposed to be on the trip. So we ended up actually, me and Stasia got ready. We actually phoned in Scylla and we headed to the all hidden inside of the big bank, not the little one. So let me just tell you, and I need to post this up on TikTok because baby, it was so beautiful inside of this place. Everything about this place was just so amazing to me, to me and to me. Let's just get into the bathroom. So Stasia had went, it was, first of all, it was too many options for bathrooms, but this was like the main, main like woman's bathroom. Look at the interior. Like I was just so, look, first of all, look at the biobs, different lip color coded. I was just so in love. The mirrors was just giving, you see my booty? Bing ball. Then I'm out there waiting. Y'all, I got free shots. And I just was sitting there. Somebody needed assistance with something. I just got free shots. Like, look at my look at my friend I had helped out that night. Free shots, free shots. Then it's just something about me just always thinking, you know, once I get free stuff from somebody, we're just automatically friends. I ended up actually talking to them people like they were my people's. Me and the security guard was actually going back and forth, actually. But I mean, hey, I was just toasting to the fact that I got free shots. When we got seated, because we were waiting on the one and only, it was just so cute. The setup in there was just so cute. Look at her. She got that purple hair, which is giving Waukesha. And then her hair was matching his outfit, and I was just feeling it. Y'all see my boy hat? Birthday boy was locked in. I was just, it was just giving too much for me, because I was just loving it. Then, the music, like, as they were playing the music, I don't know if y'all see earlier, the videos were kind of going. I don't know why I ordered this drink. I just ordered whatever drink I seen first and said, boom. Why the heck all three of us got the same thing to eat? Literally, oxtail. It just didn't make no sense. And it also gave us free for cornbread. But again, what I loved the most about this place was the vibe was just cool. The music was such a great, great, and when I mean a great vibe, it was just such a great vibe. But when I explained to you the best, probably the best part of my night was Zach, y'all, um, your stuff after you finish eating i don't know about you but back to what the best part was their hookah probably was the best hookah i have ever had ever i really wish i could have got this to go i was on that hookah so bad at this point of the night it was time for us to go and i was not trying to leave because the hookah was just so good mind y'all we stopped smoking hookah like literally like when it was time for us to eat the hookah girl came up to us as soon as we sat down they were trying to make sure we was together. The waitresses just gave, it was just a 10 out of 10. Oh, and not to mention the friend that I helped, I also got $200. So yeah, but I ain't gonna talk about why that made me mad either. 
We went out to 11.45. My girl was giving real life Little Kim vibes. Not little, but Big Kim vibes. Because my girl just looked so good. We had a section. We were chilling. Of course, my it was by the time me and my girl Stasia got there, it was after 12. So, birthday boy was locked all the way in. Like, when I say locked all the way in, he was locked all the way in. It was giving just good night vibes. Like... The custom jacket was cute. Of course, you know, got to get the hookah mommies. I could not stop. He was, my boy was so lit and Silla was just like, what he got going on? But I just felt like it's his birthday. Let him enjoy himself, sis. The vibe was going good. It was going good. It was going right. All of us was just chilling. I love a good place where I can sit up on the couch and get my feet up. Boy was in the bag just turning up with the hundreds. Love that for him. Then the third round came. And at this point, you see how he was looking? That's how I was looking. I got slapped in the face with some money, but it was okay. I got slapped in the face. Good time. You see, my phone was down, but at that point, I was just over it. I was just so over it. I was like, you know what? F it, we balled. It's the last round, and I'm ready to go. I was so ready to go. I think that slap in the face just did it for me. I was ready to go. But as you can see, all of us was lit. It was the last bottle. This is how the section was looking. It was giving real life who was cleaning it up because I surely wasn't. Stage was looking at me like I ain't cleaning it up. I got slapped again with a look, look, look. Just, just was getting slapped around with money. All I'm gonna say is this was the last video before anything else for the night. 11:45, negative three out of ten. Then we get to the next day and your girl is giving body, body, body. Like I ain't gonna hold you. This view of my body in this outfit was top mother effing tear. The boots gave. Honestly, this whole outfit is actually from Amazon if you really want to get into it. Look at the booty. Scrumptious. Unfortunately, y'all know how parking is everywhere. Out of control. So, me and Stage actually found a good park next to the actual Girl Mob Museum. And I was just so excited. Best place for content creation, yes. So, we got greeted. Do you see our platforms? So cute. She was just giving us like a little tutorial of how to use the ring lights. Y'all already know how I go when it comes to ring lights. So I was just there for the experience and the little mini tour. So we went up first. I thought the rainbow stairs were too, 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 too cute. Everything set up was amazing. Like if you go to Atlanta and you need like something like an activity to do and you're a female, definitely go to the Girl Mom Museum. The tickets were a decent price. And honestly, too, I love the simple fact that even though me and Stasia were late, she still like let us go, like let us come in. Um, basically, she treated us as a walk in and there was nobody there. So that just made it even 10 times more better and happier for me. I bet on myself because period i love this wall i thought this was just so different i've actually been to the self the other selfie mu the actual selfie museum that's in atlanta and i loved that museum too but it was just something about this museum the prints like the rooms it just it gave girl 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 and girl i love this i thought i actually want to set like some type of design up in like my next apartment for that then i went in this room and it was just giving so much valentine's day i'm just like oh my goodness like Look at the thing stuck on me. Then this was the crossover bathroom between that room and exiting out. And the mirror was just given. I went downstairs and of course I got everything that I could get. Because honestly, I'm not going to hold you. Me and Stasia probably was at 10 minutes. But she let us stay a little longer. And I just was even more happier. Because I'm just like, not only did she let us in and we were late to what we scheduled. But she let us stay a little longer so that we could get the full blown experience. Of course, I got in the pit and I loved every single second of it until I couldn't get up because I don't know why I couldn't get up. I can't swim. I really, 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 really just enjoyed. And when I say enjoyed, I enjoyed. Look at me getting in stage. My girl was taking pictures. I was so proud of her because she don't really like to take pictures, but I made sure like, yeah, friend, I'm about to get you. I'm about to get all of you. After we left, I ended up having to make a Walmart trip. And the reason I wanted to make a Walmart trip is because Columbia just never has what I need. So I ended up actually wanting to go because I wanted the Taraji P. Henson like actual body products. I know like she had lotion, sprays, etc. But I actually ended up getting a butter, a, ex a body exfoliator, an actual body conditioner for the shower. Me, I just knew Stasia was over there taking selfies. So I made sure to get her because I just knew. I just knew. The Walmart trip was actually quick. 
this is what I left with. Had to get water. Definitely um, just had to get some essentials for the Airbnb, even though I had one more day left. After laying down and packing up, I actually went on a little night little drive to my favorite place when it comes to Atlanta. For night drive, it wasn't, the traffic was not too much. It just wasn't too much. I'm so glad it was freezing because, yeah, everything was a good good one too. Papa Do's always has my heart. I always get my calamari as an appetizer, my seafood platter as my entree, and the creme brulee, the creme brulee, the creme brulee as my dessert. Whole meal was a 10 out of 10, and I still had leftovers, so I ate it again the next day. Like, it just, whew, I can't wait to go back. I definitely then, you know, got comfortable, took me a nice little bath. I didn't take it, I didn't do it Friday night, but after the shower, I definitely took me a bath Saturday night. My homeboy was not able to come in because he had a little ice storm where he was at. But the night actually ended out really cool. Me and Stasia got one of my favorites drunk. We played card games. And yeah, let's get into the content for the weekend. So the Truy definitely did a good one in the pa da 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 But honey, you know the Amazon outfit was eating up the girls. Do you see the boots? The boots, the shades, the headpiece, the hair, the brown. Like everything just gave. Baby, I was feeling like that girl in this picture. You hear me? And girl Stasia definitely did her big one with just being on top of pictures. But yes, the Truy definitely did it. The pa da 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 da's definitely did it. And I had such an amazing weekend in Atlanta. I really cannot wait to go back and do it all over again. Come on, movie babes. Thank you for tuning into my YouTube.